the valve stem diameters are the same, guides are about the same. I don't have springs on here, but the same spring package would work on both. It's all bolt patterns and whatnot. It, it's made to bolt up to the standard cam housings. Nothing crazy here. Because we've got the same number of valves, same number of plugs, same number of everything, the, the billet heads are a OEM replacement style cylinder head. But I don't know if you can notice that little port's missing. That little port right there pops out in here. That's your secondary air injection. The secondary air injection port has a nasty habit on turbo heads of blowing or torching out the seal. This cylinder head is fine. I'm not seeing that at all, but I've seen too many of these cylinder heads with this torched out and they've got this crazy exhaust leak or it sounds like you've blown a cylinder head and a liner out and <laughs> you take it apart and that's all fine. You pull the heads off the cam housings in this secondary air injection port because the exhaust pressure and temperature going down through there has torched a hole out through the side of this thing and created a nasty exhaust leak that's damaging the cylinder head. So rather than having to plug these or do some machine work or weld them or whatever you need to, they just don't exist. So you've got a much stronger head, no potential for leak path there.